Nels Christensen was cleared last night just before first pitch. Mel is expected to be back tomorrow afternoon. All right. Two members of the coaching staff for the. 0 oh, and 2 on Trent Grisham, the leadoff hitter. Who homer to lead off the fifth inning last the infield with two strikes. Into that overshift. Jake Hager is the third baseman. He collects that one 5 3 put out. Better from the left side of the plate than from the right. Zach misses down and in with a fastball. Only drag out his at bats and wear you down. And there's a little knuckle curveball in there for a strike. Fastball a little low, but it's a strike. When Crone uh, hits a home run. Uh, yeah, Tori Lovello is giving us his uh, movie review in the dugout before the game on the Crone Zone video that mm -hmm. they play. Don Orsillo, the fine broadcaster for the Padres, does a sort of the review is uh, less than sterling, let's just say, from the skipper. Big cut by Profar at that changeup, which is kind of hard. And that'll work. Nice high hop for Christian Walker and a good one, two, three start for Zach Allen. With ChazRoberts.com slash cool play. Place to submit your nomination. Dangerous DH Luke Voigt leads off the San Diego second. Zach Davies did a great job against Luke Voigt last night. Just sinkers away, change ups away, refused to come inside. He struck out twice on that pitch. And you know, Gallon's got a pretty good one himself, yeah. so we'll see how they attack him here. Batter's box. Watch him lift that left leg, swing it out there toward home plate, and then step down the third baseline looking to lift. Pull. And it's two and two on Luke Voigt. Got him. Went right back to that change. Two swings. Hitting 327. He has been holding down right field all month long, where the Padres have been without Will Myers, who's been out with right knee inflammation. So in the meantime, Azara is making the most of this opportunity. For a big guy, not going to get to that one. Maybe wouldn't that be Admiral? Yeah, you'd think so. This is a naval town after all. And Gallon gets a swing and a miss that time with a curveball. Work it out, and we'll have the answer coming up later. Here is Eric Hosmer. He was 0 for 4 last night, grounded out three times. The production has dried up from the big first baseman. Osmer has not homered since May 11th. Yeah. Boy, Zach Gallen between the changeup and that curveball has getting a whole lot of swing and miss. He has struck out. Alfaro has got some pop. He just homered in back to back game. Got the call on the four seamer. And it Alfaro, a guy who strikes out a bunch and does not walk very often. Boy, good location right there. And it's one and two. But 21. Gallon up is CJ Abrams. And Abrams knocks it into right. That's the first Padre hit. The 21 year old rookie filling in for Fernando Tatis Jr. Abrams filling in at shortstop for Tatis. Machado did not discuss his injury with reports. Still active. And Kim will do a nice. Abrams takes off. Oh boy. Man. He got a very good jump and he tripped over second. That's fouled behind Matt Williams at third. Seems odd a guy could get that kind of jump on Zach Gallon, who we know likes to throw to first. <laughs> Abrams holds. Kim hits it to pretty deep left center. Hey! 
and it's off the glove of Luplo. It rolls out to center field. Abrams on the move. He will round third. And they got Kim hung up. Nobody's at second base. And now it gets away from Hager. And Kim will dive into second. He put the brakes on halfway. That's just an E7, the error on the left fielder, Luplo, and no RBI for Kim. Grisham grounded out his first time. That bounces up the line, foul at first. Yeah, that was hit to the, a pretty deep alley out there in left center. Bar for both clubs. 0 2. Can't get Grisham to bite on that curveball. Right at the knees with a fastball, and Grisham is caught looking. That's fastball at 96, missed away, and it's one and. There is the gallop. He struck out five. Two one to Profar. Saw the curveball coming that time. And it's three balls and a strike with Jake Cronenworth on deck. You'd like to get. Well, they'll have to face Cronenworth now as Crow on a two out and a run is in. Fastball's there for a strike at its 0 1. Here's the 1 1. Took a big cut at that curveball first. 1 2 pitch. Two two. Boy, Zach Allen stealing a page out of that U Darvish playbook. It is indeed in the air to right center. Shallow though. Thomas calls off our show and Gallon strands two diamond. Boyd struck out his first time up, chasing changeups and curveballs, and starts him off with a fastball in for ball one. Another big cut at that gallon curve. That's been a tremendously effective pitch for Zach tonight, that curveball. I think he's got in Voight's head right oh, here. Oh boy, is he ever. You could kind of tell right there just <laughs> huh. with the body language. Fastball, really? I mean, Luke Voigt doesn't take inside fastballs. No. <laughs> Why not try one more now? Padres were coming off a sweep at the hands of the Rockies at Coors Field. But Voigt and Jake Cronin were. Three and two on the San Diego DH. Boy, three straight fastballs there with two strikes. Now he's going to go fastball away. Well, he loses Voigt. Second base on ball. Mazzara struck out his first time. Back to that curveball in the AZL yesterday. Now, Keiko went seven innings, gave up five hits, a couple of uh, earned runs, and I believe he struck out. And it might end up being Dallas Keiko. We'll see. Well, that's uh, maybe what they should have done with Luke Voigt. Big swing. Grounded out three times to the right side last night. Fouls that one away. One of these. Hosmer's bounce into six. Oh, boy. Gallon wanted this. Try to cut her that. Gets the swing and the miss that time. Went to the curveball one more time and make it eight strikeout.
Last ball missed away. 1-0. One two pitch. Zach. Swing and a miss. Zach Allen went to that curveball one more time. He's got nine. But there's a story to tell about that uh, beautiful woman right there, Marina Rivera, who actually caught the Buddy Kennedy Grand Diamondbacks live the pregame show and just a wonderful spirit. Longtime Diamondbacks fan. It was her dad's idea to that we showed and uh, that whole thing is up on our social media platforms but what a wonderful person and a great story no doubt Jake Hager the second baseman in for not to uh, e7 they changed that error on Luplo in the third to an RBI double for Kim has walked two, struck out nine and has a 2 1 lead in the fifth that's just foul at third flex in the left hand right there but uh, we still don't know for sure what the injury was so Josh Rojo And he's got a base hit. Kim two for two on his way to a big series. Now Kim got the big knock in the game last night. Went down and dug. Perdomo will play up the middle right behind the second base bag. Rojas near the bag at third. Now that Grisham home run in the ball game last night came on a decent pitch from Zach Davies. A sinker down low and. Well, Zach hasn't had a. <laughs> if his shoes come untied, we're going to have a delay. Right? <laughs> Change up. Boy, Zach Gallon, I tell you what, between the curtless in the series. Just missed the corner with a fastball. Fastball misses down and in. Profar, as we discussed earlier, is a tough guy to put away. He can really see a lot of pitches and wear you down. Oh boy. Well, that's Gallons for. All right. That's that 3 0 strike. Yeah, well, <laughs> that's what I've been told. <laughs> All right, well, now Gallon's put himself in a corner here because Cronenworth is the hitter. Two on and two out in a one run ball game. And that gets Brent Strom out. Kim is at second, Pro Fires at first. And the first pitch is a fastball for strike one. Cronenworth, Zach Davies. Another fastball away, it's a ball and a strike. Another fastball. That's three fastballs from Gallon. All opening. Here's the one-two to Cronenworth. Swing and a miss. Went back to that curveball. That's a career high. Eleven strikeouts for Gavin Walk. There's Joe Manta playing. By the way, uh, the word on Buddy discomfort is out of the ball game. Curveball. Good spot for it. That's right where you want to throw that. Just to have trouble covering pitches middle away. He's got a little bit better in that regard. In there with a change up that time. One in the sixth. Tried the curveball and missed. It's two and two. He's putting up a fight here. His equipment. You just tell the catcher what you want to throw. It's number 100 over the mound. Hager charges from second and they retire Voigt. And, and Bob, I asked him off camera about Jake Cronenworth. And there's the first pitch ball. And he said this, and I, I can't wait to get your reaction. He said he is our version of Craig Council in 2000. A higher praise. That's pretty high praise. I think Cronenworth has a little more pop than uh, Counts did, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I can see the comp. Well, that's a nice scoop by Christian Walker. He was with him or not. I don't think so. Here's Eric Hosmer. They were out riding trails in the desert, and uh, sure, the, uh, the, 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 the cacti, whatever they're called, thorns. Needles? Needles, there you go. Oh, 
One and two on Osborne. Another coach with Maddie and Jay Bell and Gracie. But with, you know, Mel and Bobby Welch uh, goes, the catchers get better. Uh, it's not a coincidence. He's with Buck in New York right now. Two and two. Spins him around with a fastball. Wild down there. Osmer hits a ball deep to right center. Barsha on the move. And we are tied. Well, they stayed with Gallon one batter too long. They had the lefty Manafly set to go. Gallon got two quick outs in the inning. They stuck with him for Hosmer. And it's a 2 2 ball game. Struck out twice. Mantiply is still waiting in the bullpen, standing up with Mike Fetters. Well, I would think for sure if Alfaro reaches. Good change up right there, and it's two and one. One by a Diamondback since Cole Calhoun in 2020. That's foul. Alfaro spits on that change up, and now the count is full. Gallon 114 pitch. in the corner for Luplo. Alfaro headed for second. He's going to go to third. And he is out of there. They got him.